you can see the ceiling is falling below the water. Like yeah. just these big plates, you see they, they try to make this little aquarium and there like mm -hmm. to have some some units to use but generally it's just a huge space that uh, you can't really make use of and here all of the wooden panels this is really nice like oh yeah it's columns yes very cool for some reason only two of them are made like that maybe they didn't have like time or money to finish all of those so this is the public zone and uh, you see there also the ceiling has a little bit of oh, also yeah. here like a lot of ornaments it's like a like a sky with the stars and, and some other ornaments I know let's take some pictures <laughs> what could it be? Probably tobacco packages or maybe letters or communication. <laughs> yeah, otherwise I have to go all the way downstairs and then all the way back upstairs. Yeah. Maybe when they just couldn't send the picture or something like today with the phone and you needed to have some sort of communication. Yeah. Oh, wow. This is the derelict part of the, of the same building. My God. So this is very typical for Bulgaria, I think for Eastern Europe. Like in the same building, you have part of it that is used and you have part of it that is abandoned. Maybe here it's more flat. The marble. I don't want it to. <laughs> oh yes, yes, it's very dirty. Cats live here. I don't know if homeless people still live here because it's so destroyed. But yeah, it's po this corridor is very post-apocalyptic. It is, yeah. With the Sometimes before we used to go inside, but now it's so dirty. I don't do it anymore. And there is just empty rooms, like with a lot of garbage, not even empty. So it's not worth getting dirty. Looks like a makeshift bed or something. I don't know. See, uh, it's a bit If you take too many photos, it just takes like so long to edit and decide. Well, this is it. Like uh, you never know in the end yeah. what you're gonna use, and it's best best to have the, the variety. Yeah. Choose one. See, like it's nice. Yes, I think it's just all what's left of the ceiling. There used to be a hanging ceiling. Shooting? Oh, no, it's really it, it, it is shooting all the time uh, at the moment yeah but it doesn't really like if it runs for more than 10 minutes it starts to do like weird stuff so i have to keep it's better to just do like one or two minutes and then switch it off but how to like how can i like, see these like 3d you can actually upload it straight to um uh, youtube and there are many no you can uh and there was the guy and he showed me where this box with the, with the bones were and then he showed me a door behind and he told me do you know what is this and I'm like no and he said this is just the entrance of a huge hideout like atomic bomb shelter uh -huh. and this is also not only case in Bulgaria a lot of those communist monuments also the Alosha it looks like a monument, something that probably you wouldn't necessarily bomb, but underneath them there are hideouts and atomic shelters. That's so probably, it's like yeah. a multifunction building. I guess and it makes sense, doesn't it? Because they're always, yeah. you know, like brutalist structures. Yeah, sort of they want to destroy the buildings or whatever, like where people are hiding and kill them, and they wouldn't think that there will be probably 
like yeah. something underneath and they, he said it's very big maybe even like this i don't know yeah it's raised isn't it so maybe mm. so actually if you continue on this promenade you reach the other hill with the russian soldier so uh -huh. the idea like was that before on first of may people will start from here or from there i'm not sure exactly where it's finished and uh, people commemorate the uh, communist leaders and soldiers and they do big manifestation like uh, walk here there's a big crowd and like whoa with the red flags and everything and it was compulsory it was not you go or not you have to go <laughs> if you don't go you disappear <laughs> my grandmother told me they were even watching who is really shouting and if you are just making it up that you are shouting it's a problem oh my god yeah horrible communism is very bad Wow, look, in, look at that. You can see those sculptures. Some of them were destroyed for a while in the 90s. People would come here and they started them using these like uh, quadrat boxes. This is where they put the bomb on the back. This where? One. Which one? On the background. Quadrat oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So the point here. This is like where the bombs are. I'll check them out later. All the rooms. <laughs> Some have a little bit of stuff inside, but I mostly it's now it's like oh. it's all. But next floor, we can also jump over it, but next floor there is no holes. In the first corridor, there are holes on the ground, but on the next level there are not. I even had a friend, I had a friend, I still have a friend, he's alive. <laughs> he's from this village. Yeah. He's from our wrestling gym. And um, he told me when his parents were young, when he was very young, they used to live here in one of the apartments. And yeah. he told me like, oh, is it now abandoned? I remember it so well, like uh, playing with the other kids and such a happy times, me and my brother with parents living here. Is it, how is it now? And I'm like, don't Not go good. there, <laughs> don't go there, don't go there. Keep your memories, <laughs> keep your childhood memories. He's like, oh, really? But they closed it only like 10 years ago and I'm like, what? I couldn't believe it. How much destruction for 10 years? People have been living. Oh my God, look at that. Yeah, There's always some they... sorry dog, isn't there? Yeah. Sorry looking <laughs> dog. Sorry walking. Good description. There are like small rooms, like a one room and there is for the young families, there are these doubles. Right. Huh? I don't know what it is. It's good, yeah. Yeah. 
I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come back to this. Okay, okay. 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 Okay.